rise. Support court with Judge Vanda B is now in session. Judge's case number JVB1065, McIntosh's case. Thank you. You're welcome. You all may be seated. <clears throat> okay, Mr. McIntosh, you brought this case before the court. What's going on? Well, I think uh, she needs to pay child support. Okay. Just straight like yeah, that? Yeah, straight. We want, I want to get straight to the point. I just want nothing to do with it. I just want child support. All right. You, I mean, do you really know her? You, you just said, like, you don't want nothing to do with it, like you just met her yesterday. Well, I, th I thought I did. Okay. Tell me about it. Well, it started off like every other fairy tale, you know. Everything was hot, bad. Everything cooking good. Good loving. So we got a kid. Okay. We we'll say, okay, so when the kid arrived, that kind of changed. You know, daddy got put on the back burner. And, you know, sometimes it, I'm not understanding. I say, what happened to dad? You know, you, you let the kid go to sleep or something. Don't, don't just forget about me. Mm. So it was all about, you know, I got the baby, the baby. No, no, put the baby to bed. Well, you wanted to tend to the baby, right? Well, uh, yeah, what else yeah. I'm going to do? Well, not that much. Don't just forget about me. I mean, it's you know, about you know, daddy. Around the house. You know, it's, it's just all about child, the baby. Though. It's just all about the baby. The baby don't what happened to baby? Yeah, but you can't forget about daddy. Exactly. What's about the baby daddy. gonna do? You an adult. See, forget about it. See what I'm talking about? It's a child. Cannot forget about dad. And once that, that's a baby. That baby sleep eight hours a day. No. So I gotta feed the baby. I gotta make sure the baby's clothes and everything. There's a lot of work to put into taking care of a kid. There really you is. You an adult. So you know how to take I'm, care of yourself. I'm helping. She's not doing nothing by herself. I am also helping. So once I, I always give her a break, so I can get some of my, some daddy time, some us time, get that back. You know, it was great at first, but it just you I don't say know. at first. How long were y'all together? What six, it was six years. That's a long time to be together. Yeah, okay. but then the baby just popped up, and I'm like, you know, she forgot about me. And so I try to, you know, let me take care of the baby. Let me, let me let you rest, so you can start back paying attention to me. All right. And that don't seem. Do y'all still live together? That don't. No. No, that, no, that don't seem to... Not anymore. All right. Not anymore. Uh, okay, how old is the child now? I'm assuming it's not a baby anymore. The child's about six. Six? Okay. Yeah, had him right off. Right, kind of early. Okay. And that kind of, I think that's, I think that kind of threw it off a little bit by having the kid so early. And it, uh, should have waited a little while, but hey, baby wanted to come, so baby's here now, so. So the baby wanted to come. The baby wanted to be here, so. Like I said, I help out to try to get, you know, give her a break or something. Maybe bring up some wine and cook for her every now. I don't like, you know, but it don't seem to, it's just like, I guess you're going through that after, I don't know what you call it, after the baby's here, that that's some kind of phase you go through. Okay. But you're not paying attention to that. Postpartum. You know, post, yeah, what you exactly, said. Exactly, yeah. that's serious. Postpartum is a serious thing to go through. So, of it course, is. it's going to be now, a disconnect. Not for five years. How are you going to tell a woman that postpartum is something that's terrible to go through. How, you've never been through it. So how do you know? Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting on that explanation, too. Please tell well, me. Well, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. But all I know is I help out to try to, you know, help out with the baby to try to understand what you're going through. That's why it's I try to... That's why I take, issues. That's why Can I try we to stop you. referring to this six-year-old as a baby? That's... It's my I child. I try to take care of our child. But you need to be able to tend to me and the child and try to understand where I'm coming from because depression is a mental thing. You know, there's medication. Some people have suicidal thoughts. You don't even know what I mean. You never even tried to ask me what I was going through or how I even felt. She makes a good point. Okay. I'll so take that. it takes a lot. It takes a lot for you to understand where I'm coming from. You can't just assume, okay, I'm not just trying to tend to you. I have to tend to my mental health and my child. That takes a lot of work. But I can't, I can't read your mind. I don't know. But that's, you never tried to even talk to or try to understand me from that point. Did, did the two of you come here to waste my time? I mean, he's the one that called it in here. I'm just here. I mean, he obviously wanted me to do something. Obviously, been, and I'm just trying to get to what that something is. Our I want full custody, and I want child support. Okay. The child live well with you? It's kind of between right about now. But I think I could take care of him better since she can't keep a job. I've been with the kid longer, so I mean, I, I'm not working right now, so I'm at home with the kid all the time. So, so if she's not working, she behind bars. 
<laughs> wait a minute. Behind bar. Yeah, wait, yeah. wait a minute. Mr. McIntosh, let me let me move over here to her okay, so I okay. can hear her side of the story. What is this behind bars? Well, because of how he's been feeling, okay, he's been feeling neglected because I was having issues with depression and taking care of my kids. So he decided to step out. So, you know, me and my girl did some digging and I found out he stepped out on me. So you know what? I have to find out where the girl went, where she worked at. So you went and found I his sure new did. girlfriend? I her butt. He did I not sure have did. to jump on her. Why she was at I work? I did. Because he's not about to play me after all this stuff I've been doing with his kid. He's not about to do that. That's a little ratchet. Yeah, no so reason. I did. I did. There was no reason. There's nothing else it was I could call do. For. I did it. So you have a, a, a case pending on you? I do, unfortunately, I do. But you don't cheat on me after all this work I've been putting in taking care of your child. You gonna cheat on me? No, it's not gonna, it's not gonna fly. Oh. Well, what happened to the depression? What happened I'm, to all that? You can't oh, it's in there. That's you one of the side effects, fight. My though. New girlfriend, That's one you, of the side effects, the baby effects, while you fighting? That's one of the side effects, That's a though. great question. What yeah, was you the baby while you were fighting? Because I'm upset. I'm mad, and then you're not even trying to make me feel better. What was the child while you were fighting? What was the child fighting my girlfriend? Oh, that was taking care of my sister was watching the Your kid. Sister. She was. She was, was she in jail with you? No, she was watching the kid. And she bailed me out. Oh. She was there for me. You were. My sister bailed her out. She you were there. Her she was there for was me. There so I guess you talk to your sister. You won't talk to me. Because you, you don't talk even to try your sister, to. But you can't talk you to me. You don't even try. I tried to talk to you. It seems like you guys can't really talk to each other without getting into it. Not, yeah. So you don't even yeah. try to listen to I'll me. I'll go back no. to my original yeah. question. So who does the child stay with majority of the me. time? He stays with me, Yana. Okay. So you said that the baby was better off with you yeah. because she has a assault case. She got a soul case. But she, she didn't do it in front of She can't keep a job. Okay, what do you do for a living? I'm in the entertainment business. What does that mean? I produce. Yeah, he what, what are you producing? Right. I got several artists I'm trying to produce right now in the mm -hmm. music business, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, late night. Okay. Producing. Have they already produced some music? Yeah, it's kind of iffy right now, but I think they're going to be okay. Yeah, what kind of money are you making? Right. Uh, I'm making about eighty, eighty-five thousand. Okay. All right. And you said you're unemployed right now. Yes, ma'am. What happened to your job? I had to quit because I was taking care of the kid full time. Okay. So the child lives with her. Stays with me. Okay. Why didn't you file anything for today for child support? I wasn't thinking about it. I didn't want to be malicious towards him or anything, so I didn't feel the need I had to. So that's just where I stand on that. Okay. Is your sister also helping you with that criminal she case? She is. Okay. And she also helps me watch the kid if I'm needing to do anything, like any grocery shopping or anything. She helps me. All right, so where does dad come in? I mean, he's rarely around. I mean, he's doing his little producing thing and stuff and meeting up with late women and stuff. You know, that's why I had this little charge. So, I mean, that's what he's doing. It's a little charge? I mean, it's an assault charge, but I mean, <laughs> it is what it is at this point. It already happened, so. Okay, I do agree with that. Well, sir, um, I'm not going to grant your request for child support I today. I am not manipulating women. You got you one are. girlfriend and you jumped on her. You are, no, there's so You tell the judge more. about your sister, it's she going back more. to jail. It's plenty more. Oh, okay. Well, guess what? I, I don't have to. time to hear about all of these little rendezvous today. I have other mm -hmm. things to do, and you obviously came here to waste my time. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to deny your relief, like I said, and dismiss your case, because it's obvious that the child stays with mom primarily. You didn't dispute it when she said it. Therefore, I don't have a choice but to dismiss it. And mom, on the other hand, if she comes back in here and says she wants child support because had she filed something today, you would actually be being, you would actually be placed on child support today. Me? But at, yes, you, at that 80 to $85,000 range because the child lives with her. She's telling the truth, isn't she? Yeah. Okay, and I'm pretty sure she's telling the truth about the other stuff too. But no, no, that's no, none no, of my no, business. No, 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 no. So, is there anything further today, Mr. McIntosh? No, ma'am. Okay, is there anything further, ma'am? No, Your Honor. Okay, well, if there's nothing further, you all are dismissed. Thank you. 
Hi guys, it's me, Judge Vonda B. I wanted to go over what you witnessed in the McIntosh case. So dad was bringing mom to court. He was pretty much frustrated with her. They had dated on and off for six years. He wasn't getting any type of attention from mom after the two of them brought a child into this world. Well, you also heard mom say that she'd been unemployed because she was the one staying home and pretty much taking care of the child. Well, can you put somebody on child support if the child does not live with you? Technically, no, you cannot. Dad wanted to place mom on child support, but after you heard both of them testify, it was obvious that the child primarily lived with mom. Therefore, dad would not be entitled to any child support benefits. Well, what is something else that you heard? Mom said that she didn't want to bring dad to court to place him on child support. But the reality of it is, guys, if mom had filed a petition at the same time that dad filed his petition for child support, there's a high likelihood that dad would have been placed on child support in that particular scenario. So if for any reason she wants to come back later and place dad on child support, if the child is still staying with her, she may be able to do that. And it's that simple.